I went from being, because uh, at the time before all, all the cancer stuff, I was like working out, I was in boot camp and, you know, it's just a regular, healthy, normal person. But after that, it's like everything just totally changed. I had to go from being that healthy person to um, having to go through chemo, losing my hair, and just my whole health just spiraled out of control. It's like when I was doing chemo, it's like the, I guess the medicine and stuff that they use, it just wreaks havoc on your body. Thank God I only had to do three chemo treatments, but it was strong enough to do some damage. So I went from having all kinds of health issues stemming from that that I never had before. And I remember talking to the doctor and he said, well, when you, you know, you have chemo, you're going to lose some hair. You know, and at the time I had, you know, a thick head of hair. So it was like, it wasn't like, you know, it just, it started coming out. But when it, it did come out, I was, I remember being at work and I said, you know, my head is itching, you know, real bad. I'm sitting up there scratching my head and all of a sudden I felt my hand slip. And when I looked at my hand, I had a clump of hair and then I jumped up and I was like, oh my goodness, did anybody see that? You know, but thank God my coworkers didn't see that. I said, well, excuse me, I'm going to go to the bathroom real quick. And I'm just doing, and I remember my hair was just coming out, but thank God it was thick enough that it wasn't noticeable, you know, but then after a while it got to a point where I could just sit there and just do like this and just like handfuls would come out. And I remember my daughter sitting down, she's oh my God, mommy, your hair is coming out. And she just, me and her just sat there and we were just, I had a bag and we were just taking it, taking it out and putting it in the bag. And so all of it was just gone. And um, it's not like you, you, the doctors tell you to expect that, but when it, you know, and you saying, okay, I know what's going to happen. But when it actually does happen, it's like, wow, you know, I didn't think it was going to be this bad. And I remember my husband, you know, shaving his head. He said, well, I was crying. He's like, you know what? Well, until your hair goes back, I'm going to shave all mine off, you know, and then when yours go, it'll grow back together. But I've got chills. Than- I've got goosebumps. <laughs> Me too. Yeah, that was sweet of him because most guys, you know, they're like, oh, you know, I'm not going to cut my hair yeah. <laughs> off. He, he shaved it completely bald and then. As it started growing back, you know, he let his grow back, but it still hasn't come back the way that I, you know, thought it would. So that was another thing. That was a big disappointment.